We can design machines to move 20-story buildings, float them out to the side, and with one pound of force, we can move a building a ton of weight. All of the new cities will be a university in essence. The center of the city, the nucleus, will house an electronic computer which only controls the weather, water purification, the atmospheric conditions, that is, it controls air contamination systems. The computers do not control people. They maintain safety, they oversee the environment, maintain ecological balance between animal life and plant life. All the machines do is control the physical entities that comprise the environment. The center of the city is a university, a university that covers all subjects related to man. It is not a commercial university. There's no courses that are used to exploit or abuse any other human being. All business courses will be phased out. All repetitious jobs will be phased out. We feel that machines ought to do the filthy or the repetitious or the boring jobs. That man has to be free to pursue the higher things, the higher possibilities of man. In other words, if this is the medical unit, this little branch, and if you work in this center, you may live in the garden cities that surround the center. You don't have to, you can if you will. There's circular conveyor belts that take you anywhere in the city in three minutes. The cities are all immersed in beautiful gardens. There are no trees in a row. It is not a mechanical environment. It is essentially a city immersed in a second Garden of Eden, where there are lakes, recreation areas, art centers, music centers, cultural centers, and surrounding the city, we have the agricultural belt where we grow foods hydroponically. Between cities, we let everything go back to nature, the deer, the coyote, the entire ecological balance is maintained. Most of the homes will be individually contoured. If you're an artist, you'll live in the kind of house that is most suitable to your areas of interest. If you're a technician, a musician, the house will be designed for your needs. Most of the houses will be self-generative. That is, the heat of the sun falls upon your roof and lowers the temperature on the inside of the house. The sunlight is scattered on the inner wall in which you have a phosphor coating and the room glows all evening with a soft glow without any electricity, without any power waste. All of the pavement in the area is black. Under the pavement are heating coils, that is, built-in PVC tubing or wiring or conveyor tubing for water. As the sun beats down on the pavement, we get all the hot water we need without burning any fuel, conserving energy all over the world at a much lower cost. Some individuals may want to live in a way out house. How far way out, how far out you want to live, would be determined by your value system and your lifestyle. It is not a restricted society, but it is something brand new. Some individuals will live in homes of a different design. There will be a wide range of what you call individuality. The city is built to bring out creativity, thinking, development, to question all things and challenge all ideas. The city is not utopian. It is an open city to develop all ideas, to change our concepts when they need to be changed. That all the buildings will be earthquake proof, fire proof, termite proof, and shock resistant in that they will rest on this particularly designed sand bay so that no direct shock can be transferred to the architecture. There are no fire departments because nothing in the architecture can burn. There are no television sets, radios, tape recorders, or record players. All of that is done by the central computer system in which all of the world's music is housed in a central computer. You don't want records, tape recorders, all this junk that requires continuous maintenance. All you want is the music you like. You dial it and you get the music. You don't need to pick up records or store them. You live in an insane culture where we duplicate things. It's like having a television station in every home or every apartment building. All you want is the music or the program. You dial that, all you need is an image screen built in on the wall. You don't have a set sticking out. You